Will his pregnant girlfriend pass the loyalty test? How you feeling? Cool, cool, cool. You ready for this one? Man, you gotta be ready, man. Mm. About to put her up to this test. She got me in Coming the blender. I'm trying to figure out what the going on. Yeah, I right feel now. it, man. I feel it. Today, we're replacing Jozark's pregnant girlfriend, Sierra, to the test. Will she remain loyal to him or will she trade him for a. No, like, why is you impregnating her before you trust her, bro? Like, what's up, bro? Another rich and successful guy. So, so if there was no kid, you wouldn't be here. Oh, not at all. Not at all? I'm just gonna find me another one. <laughs> I'm about to open the door right now. I'm about to let you in. Yo! This loyalty test will take place at this million dollar home. Our friend Isaiah no. is pretending. You know who she looked like, chat? She looked like Joe from you when she smiles. Yo! Never mind. Ah, uh, my fault, my fault. Wrong. Uh, my bad. Sorry. No, wrong. This loyalty test will take place at this million dollar home. Our friend Isaiah is pretending that he lives here. Madeline will convince Sierra to come over, and when the time is right, Isaiah will ask her on a date, allowing Jozar to find out if she will remain loyal. So she hit you up saying that she's pregnant, mm. and it's yours. She's saying it's mine, but you know. You don't think it's yours? It ain't no evidence proving that we together, but you know, we trying to solidify everything with the trust so you know we're making it work for now being for, there for the kid is what's most important yeah that's a okay. fact man if she loved then i'll apply myself to the situation as a whole and maybe we can make it work but if not then i'm gonna just keep going on about my way that kid is fucked. my girl says she's pregnant but i don't think it's mine because she'd be outside too much we've had issues in the past so let's set up a test on her that was the crazy dm that jozar sent and after hitting him up and learning more we found out that he makes music and she's a dancer they met while working together they did and let me guess they live in la for a year and then they broke up the entertainment industry as a whole you know as both of us being involved with different aspects of music and dancing it ain't really work out you know trust and everything wasn't really working out so gotcha. we decided to just break it off gotcha a couple months after breaking up though Jozar and sierra would reconnect on a night out i was doing my one two for like four months and i caught her in the club again we made our connection but we kept it platonic after that and she hit me up like a month later and said she had yeah. a baby so it was like and it's yours she's saying this mom but you know you don't think it's yours it ain't no evidence proving that it's all hypothetical because you know we did have our consensuals but she could have been doing that with anybody and at the end of the day i caught her at the club so you know how i get when you out enjoying yourself i was nigga just he's right he's right but like damn bruh what if he's wrong what if he's wrong and it is his his kid is gonna have like a prologue before he was born and he was in his mom's belly <laughs> and this one this, this one nigga's gonna grow up and see it was just probably her option for that night I'm just trying to make sure that it wasn't others before me. After telling him that she was pregnant, Sierra told Jozart that they should try to work things out between What's them. Wrong with they the should DNA try test? to be a family for the baby's sake. And Jozart's down for that if the baby is his. She came back into your life and said, I got a baby and I want to make this work. What did you say to her when she said that? Really? Are you sure? That's the first thing, of course. Our Bro, who the fuck would want to plant a baby on an up and coming artist? <laughs> Isn't, there's no richer nigga they could plant the baby on? <laughs> Me, Fluxinator, you're banned. <laughs> Don't ban him for real. My fault. I just trying to be queso. Are, are you sure? Then is it mine? But you know, it's kind of always going to throw the situation left. And <laughs> nigga said exile. Bad light when you accuse her. Yeah. We together, but you know, we trying to solidify everything with the trust. So, you know, we making it work for now. Jozar and Sierra initially broke up because of trust issues, so of course there's gonna be doubts. Hopefully those doubts go away though with this loyalty test. And I'm not gonna lie, I was very hesitant about doing this video, primarily because there's an innocent third party involved. We went through with everything though, because Jozar said he'd be there for the kid, whether Sierra stayed loyal or not. Okay, if of course, good. the baby is his. He's capping, I think, is but... always the better option within bro, the game. Bro, if that's not his baby, he's not gonna be there for the baby, bro. No, that's a good ass question, chat. Are you gonna be there for a baby that's not yours? Pole, 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 pole. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know, bro, because you gotta think. First of all, the baby's a loser in the situation, right? But worse than that, how is you supposed to be responsible for a child you didn't, that's not yours. It's not your body. I mean, if you wanna help out a child that's not yours by blood, you can always do that. There's plenty of opportunities to adopt and things of that nature. Damn, 95%. Yo, to the 5% of people saying yes, like, why?
all the daddy. Now that's a good point. There's actually like during this whole question, there's a nigga currently abandoning his kids, bro. And he is not taking responsibility. Or yeah, bro. And for there for the kid is what's most important. So if she stays loyal, what happens then? If she loyal, then I'll apply myself to the situation. But until then, she on thin ice. Hey girl, uh, I just wanted to make sure that we're still on for today to go over choreo. Yeah, I'm still good. Oh, if okay, he, perfect. I'm gonna head pay, over to the producer's house soon. I'll send you my ATA. Okay, see you soon. See you soon. The first step of her plan was getting Sierra to come to this house. So a couple days ago, we had Madeline ask her to create some dance choreography for one of her songs in exchange for some good money. Sierra was interested and even suggested meeting at a dance studio that she frequents. However, as planned, Madeline preferred to meet at her producer's house. Hey, this is nice. This is crazy. They got the rabbit fur carpet. It's crazy. <laughs> Shoot, I feel like I can get used to this. She gonna see this car and that's gonna let me know right there. From She's the gonna car. get the full test right now. She's gonna get the full <laughs> test. The million dollar home is gonna make Isaiah look rich, but this four hundred and seventy five thousand dollar Rolls Royce is gonna add some crazy credibility. Here's my favorite feature. Bloop. Whoa! Umbrella! How much is this umbrella? Thirty two hundred. Thirty two hundred dollars. I'm about to be like, hey, how much is the car? How much you think this umbrella is? That's the flex. I think you can film a gold digger video with just the umbrella. Bro. <laughs> The owner of this umbrella and the Rolls Royce is our friend Kyle. Today he'll be playing Isaiah's driver. After showing Isaiah how to work the car, setting everything up, and adjusting our plan a bit because of the rain, everyone eventually got into position. So you said you're Yo, my fault. I was about to yap and I caught myself. That's growth. That's all that is. But you have baby mama Joe? Yeah, I got two kids already. How's it going with the other baby mamas? They pretty cool, no, you know, it's it be it was rocky at first, but you know, the best thing about it is they let me see my kids and talk That's to good. my kids. How do you drive this car? This is half a million dollars? You can drive it after afterwards. I don't think you want me to drive. <laughs> you see the color of my skin, bro? <laughs> <laughs> what? No, Hello? no, you you're a good driver. Is it safe? I think this is it. Okay, perfect. Um, I have parking in the driveway for you. I just found some street parking. I'm like super close. Just park in the driveway because I don't want you to get towed. They usually start towing cars around four. <laughs> nigga says setting his people back. <laughs> then another nigga said Tokyo Drift. You don't even know if he's Japanese. <laughs> nigga, you just named some place in Asia. He might be from there. I don't know. Fuck it, man. Nigga, Seoul. <laughs> Nigga, Shanghai. Nigga, just start naming cities. Fuck it, bro. Oh, really? <laughs> Pull into the driveway. I'm coming out right now. Is that her? She's right there, yeah. Okay, we're starting, we're starting, we're starting. Madeline had to convince Sierra to park in the driveway. Okay, pulling up right now. Do you I see me? Oh, okay, then. Cool. Let's okay. pull up right here. Right there. That right here? Yeah. There we go. She's parking in the driveway. Perfect. This was a simple but important task. You guys will see how we use this to our advantage later. Nice to finally meet you. How was the drive? Oh, actually not too bad. Thank God it stopped raining. Okay, here we go. We'll stop your guns. Well, I hate talking so about much, the weather so chat. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. One thing at a time. Yeah, you know? exactly. Um, we could just, I already set up the mirror here. I was thinking we just do here. Oh, okay. This is the producer. Hey, guys. Um, WW Curly Air. Nice meet you. Isaiah. All right, they met, first contact. Uh, if you wanna just put your stuff down, yeah. we, yeah, yeah, that's right. Madeline now had to make this entire thing believable. So before they start working on the dance choreo for her song, she makes small talk with Sierra, all while Isaiah pretends to get work done. We could do like something for TikTok, something pretty short. It doesn't have to be like super, you know, like, crazy, yeah. you know? Yeah. I mean, we could just start. Get into it. We yeah. could just. Eventually, the girls move on to creating the choreo. Yeah, we're just gonna give them some time She's here tough, to do their thing. Lies. She's and tough. then I'm gonna be giving Madeline a call and getting her out of the scene. I got legends watching me get done dirty. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Turning in their graves right now watching this shit happen. <laughs> Five, two, three, four. Have you ever owned a uh, Honda Civic? Yes, I have a Honda Civic. Nigga, you can't see her. Okay. I started off broke just I'm like I'm extrapolating. <laughs> Based on what I can see. She's gonna be so mad at Madeline at the end of this. <laughs> I know, dude, how was Madeline feel that she's getting so friendly with her? It's funny though, now that I've settled down, more girls hit on me now than I did when I was single. But it's getting your loyal. Run. Sergio and I are gonna come out with the camera. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> if we don't like it, we can just, you know, change it. Change the yeah, just like... If she passes the test, do you plan on telling her that this was a test? Or would you? Nah. Some things are better left unsaid. I feel it. I feel it. She'll never come across this video. 
And if she does, remember, guys, you deny, deny, deny. <laughs> <laughs> that or, oh, I was just so high, I don't even remember. Nigga, for sure cheated. Nigga, for sure cheated. The dance was coming out pretty nice, and so was the sun. After 45 minutes, it was time to move things along. <gasps> Ooh. What's up? My manager's calling me. Hold up. Hello? Oh, uh, hey, Madeline. You got some time to talk? Otherwise, your music video might not happen. Yes, give me one second, give me one second. I gotta take this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, go ahead, no worries. <laughs> hey, I'll be right back. Why nigga sound like, like that? Minutes. You can just talk like a normal person. Shit crazy. And just like that, we got Madeline out of there. We were one step closer to Isaiah making his move. She left you for a manager? Yeah. Yeah. You can't tie her down for too long. That girl stays busy. I saw what you guys are doing though, it's looking good. You like it? Yeah, it's all the little, I, I'm not gonna do it, I can't do it. I the pressure <laughs> in, man, the pressure. How long have you been dancing for? Honestly, like my entire life. Alrighty, Kyle, go ahead and make your entrance, over. You, uh, you dance full time right now? Yeah, I've been super blessed to get like hella gigs back to back. That's dope. Yeah, so you produce like all of the you know, music? I wouldn't say all of it, we have like 20 something songs together. I produced this track. Wait, what the yeah. fuck is that? Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, no, wait. Really... what are they doing in the car? I, maybe I just zoned out. What the fuck is they doing in the car? Good. How long have you been uh, making music? Not as long as most people that I know. Mm. I've only been doing it for like seven years. So it's like, it's yeah. A long time. Yeah. It's a lot of work, but yeah. we love it. Yeah. This is just showing it? Yeah. Yeah. You don't need to show a $500,000 car. They're in like a $5 million mansion. <laughs> They got money. <laughs> They're not driving a Prius. It's beautiful. Appreciate it. She real f***ing curious. Been here for like two years. Really? Mm-hmm. So you like it here? I love it here. Yeah. Yeah. Nigga say you never know. The fact that she even <laughs> entertaining this conversation alone is already a rough <laughs> right. Ideally, what would you want her to say or do? That she here for business that ain't got nothing to do with her. Madeline ain't in the room. She's supposed to be minding her business. Mm. You do anything other than dance? You play any sports growing up? Yeah. What's up, Isaiah? What's up, my guy? What's, What's good, happening? bro? How's she looking? Dude, your car still looks fresh. I mean, the car wash was closed, but oh, the man. inside needs some work. It's a little wet, but works. Cool. So there's a car that's blocking the driveway, the Dodge Charger. Oh, that's a good strat. Do you mind if I move it? I'm going to move it in really quickly, and then I'll put the Rolls Royce right behind it. Oh, I can just move it. I got it. I mean, it will be a tight squeeze, if, so I would rather just not any of the car get scratched, and I'll just do yeah, it. Got you. Perfect. You guys want to come out with me? He does this thing for a okay, living, Okay, that's by the good, way. that's you know, good. I was wondering how I was going to bring it up. Manage cars. Oh, here we go. Madeline convinced Sierra to park in the driveway so that we could force her to come back outside without even trying. So I'm going to need your car key, and I'm going to move it right up. Sierra thinks that Kyle is just driving her car into the garage so that he could then pull in Isaiah's car into the driveway. While technically, yes, this is true, it's not the main reason why we dragged her out here. Perfect, thank you so much. Let me move this one right in. As I mentioned earlier, Kyle is pretending to be Isaiah's driver who just got his car detailed. That's my baby right there. You like it? Yeah, it looks really nice. The car was supposed to be super clean. Isaiah was supposed to be impressed by Kyle's work and then tip him a generous amount. But because of the rain, it didn't make sense to do that anymore. Funny enough though, the sun ended up coming out after all. I would say I can take you on a drive, but I don't know if Madeline would be happy if I took you away. So <laughs> we, <laughs> she did leave you though. Okay, I don't a little know. bit of pressure. No, we can hop inside. Yeah. Oh, we can for sure go inside. Yeah. All right, here we go. Are she talking about some, oh yeah? Talking about some, oh yeah? Bitch! Don't tell me you're about to fail. You're literally pregnant. This is impossible. Come on, bruh. You are pregnant, ma'am. Our new plan was for Isaiah to simply invite Sierra to check out the inside of the car, which he did flawlessly. I got you. Yeah. She ain't feel yet. Appreciate she pregnant? You. Yeah, she pregnant. Let me get you your key, bro. Damn. She's, she see the car she choosing already. Isaiah effortlessly she gets ain't feel yet, the car. But and I didn't notice this at the ooh, time, but when close. she hops into the car, she immediately starts checking herself out. Is she? All right, so the only reason why I'm saying she hasn't failed yet is because if you show me an R34, I'm not a gold digger, but I'd want to sit inside it, right? 
That's the only reason I'm saying she hasn't failed. Like, that's my favorite car. You gonna bring my favorite car? Nigga, I'm gonna sit inside my favorite car, my nigga. Can I sit inside my favorite car? Now, now if the internet was like, oh, this nigga's a whore. He's about to fuck her. No, nigga, I'm sitting inside my favorite car. Fuck off of me. So that's why I'm saying, like, let's give her the benefit of the doubt. Feel me? If she's gonna fail, then she'll fail, bro. You trying to make sure she looks good? Is she just fixing her hair from all the dancing? I don't know. What do you guys think? Is this a red flag? You don't gotta check it yourself. Is you look it good. is a red flag. Fly pressure, come on. With Sierra now in the Rolls Royce, there was only one last step in our plan. Isaiah was now free to finally make his move. How do you think she's doing so far? Yeah. She on thin ice and it's cracking. She is. Oh, come on, stop edging me! I hate when I'm being edged. She edge. still ain't made any actions that she can't come back from, but she's entertaining too much for sure right now. Simple fact that she's sitting in the car already about enough. I had them do the interior custom made. On the back right here, you can't really see, mm -hmm. but if you push these buttons, yeah. that pops out like that. Ooh, <laughs> yeah. That's nice. This is my second car. I got the other car in the shop. Oh, wow. But I like driving this one mm, a lot. Nice. This is my baby. Yeah. Is this like your dream car? or? Oh, for sure. <laughs> yeah, this costs way too much to not be my dream car. How much is it? That is not some shit a rich nigga would say. No rich nigga's dream car is a Rolls Royce. <laughs> <laughs> Most what did they say? They said the average Rolls Royce owner has seven other cars. Bro, it's gonna be like an Aston Martin. It's gonna be like a, a fun car you grew up loving. It's never a Rolls Royce. They just get the Rolls Royce because they got fuck you money. And they for sure aren't calling it expensive, these fucking millionaire fucks. Yes. I don't really know cars like that. <laughs> just by looking at it. I would say maybe like a hundred thousand. You say a hundred thousand? Wait, hold on. There's human beings that there's human beings that walk on this earth thinking Rolls Royces are a hundred thousand. <laughs> you don't have to know cars. Oh man, ma'am. Lord have mercy. Is it more or less? That is crazy. That's for a while. You really said $100,000. You can just tell her the number, bro. God damn. <laughs> Am I wrong? I feel insulted. That's, hey, that's wild. I told you I don't know cars like that. <laughs> it costs 400000 Yeah. $400,000. Mm -hmm. No way to Swear to God. It costs that much? Yeah. No. Okay, this only works on gold diggers. I swear. Bro, this is so cringe. Bro, who is this working on? I can't, yo, for like for the life of me, I just don't want to believe this shit works on people. Bro, what? 400,000. Yeah, yeah, this is my $400,000 car. Yeah. Why? What I, I don't, 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 don't want to believe this works, bro. That's literally the price of a house. I never actually thought about it like that. Go. Here we go. Well, so I'm now Sierra knows the price of the car, which, side note, is actually $475,000 before taxes. And yes, that includes the umbrella. So, uh, you live far from here? I'm like 40 minutes now. Unless yeah. you buy it used, That's used. That's not far at all. Yeah, not too far. Yeah. You got any plans this weekend? I don't know yet. Pri, I'm gonna take you out. Wrong answer. I'm just trying to give you some plans. Yeah, she's about to cheat. She said, why? That's a cheating, that's a cheating response. You should have shut it down. She's about to cheat right now in three, two, one. Yeah. She's cheating right now. I'm gonna be real. Yeah, be real. I'm in a predicament right now. What? I got this beautiful woman in my car. Oh. And I feel like I would be dumb not to ask her out on a date. She'd be dumb to say yes. You wanna ask me on a date? I would love to. She's about to lose her dad. Well, why do you wanna take me out on a date? Oh, wait, wait, you're wait. beautiful, you're talented, mm. you're sexy. The list goes on. I can keep going if you want me to. Mm. I want someone I can spend my time with, give my time to. Mm. I want to spend my time with you. All right, ma'am. Now think about it. You are actually pregnant right now. You are pregnant right now. The dad, the father of your baby in your stomach, okay, in your little belly, he's listening to this. You don't know that, but still, you are about to lose. You're about to become a single mom. <laughs> no cap. 
You're about to become a single mom with the next thing you say. It's all, all comes down to this, man. All right, you about to cheat? <laughs> you about to cheat, you just get just cheat. Get it out the way. She don't even know when people lie to her. That's she making it easy for them too. I'll pick you up in this. I'll have a whole bouquet of flowers in the back. Flowers? I'll make a song for you. You might be selling the whole nine. You might yeah. be selling. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh, she's a single mom. Yeah, no. we can figure whatever she's out. gonna be a single mom. Damn, already. Damn. Like she ain't pregnant. She's gonna be a That's single mom. On. You think she'll actually show up? It don't matter if she's showing. Just opening the door, giving them access. That's already Bro, enough. She just, this is crazy. Bro, she just condemned that kid to just like a way lower quality of life, man, with this one bad decision. Fuck. See, because Sierra is pregnant. She's pregnant. She's in a relationship with Joe's heart cooked. because she wants to be a family. Yet she's over here agreeing to go on dates with other guys. What do you want to eat? Honestly, I have no idea. Like, I'm usually pretty indecisive. Oh, got you, miss. Indecisive. Just pick. You, you pick. Yeah, nigga, you pick. What did you ask it for? I don't know. We can do spicy food. How about this? I'll pick you up. Okay. We can be spontaneous. Okay. We can figure it out on the day, and then after, we can come back, chill. Like, come back to here? Yeah. At your crib? At my crib. <laughs> but, yeah. yeah. I can't say this on camera in Women's History Month. She's a whore. Feel sorry for the kid. Uh, my fault, guys. My camera went out, but it's back now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Damn. She ready. Look at her just choosing. Though. What the wrong with this? I can make some drinks. I'm actually kind of nice. I actually used to be a bartender back in the day. No kind of nice with it, yeah. Before I started doing this producer thing. No way. Yeah. <laughs> There's no way. Mm -hmm. What do you know how to make? <laughs> Once again, Isaiah decided to push this phase even further, and this time it seems to be working out for him. I can make whatever you like. Mm. What do you like drinking? Wait, why? Wait, why is she drinking? Wait, wait, wait! What the fuck? Oh nah! No, 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 no. Everyone doesn't need to be a mom, bro. Nah, everyone doesn't need to be a mom. I just peeped that. Dog, I I don't drink. So y'all niggas had to tell me, is there a certain point in your pregnancy where you have to stop drinking? Or are you just not supposed to do it at all? You can't drink at all. <laughs> they can say, y'all think it's his kid? <laughs> nah, I feel bad for the kid though, no cap. That's the loser in this. That's actually the loser in all this. It's tough, bro. Okay. More of like a tequila gal. Okay. You know? What are we rocking with the tequila? Margarita. I kill some rice sometimes. Okay. I already got the pineapple juice and that orange juice in the fridge right now. Oh, so you just ready. Oh, I stay ready. You stay ready, you don't gotta get ready, you feel me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she, she's talking about drinking while she's supposed to be pregnant. What's That's what that's I that's what y'all said. That's true, damn, I didn't even think of that. After that we can, you know, just see where the night goes. Okay. I'll be down with whatever. Yeah, I like being spontaneous. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She's gonna fuck oh him for sure. Boy. She about to fuck him for sure. She don't got no respect for herself. She's just making it so easy. This was a complete and utter fail. Sierra knows exactly. But you know what's crazy, chat? I'm a cynical nigga, bro. Okay, I'm a real cynical nigga, bro. If all this wasn't caught on camera, I feel like she would plant the kid on him. <laughs> she would fuck him and be like, oh, it's your kid. Dead ass, bro. Exactly what Isaiah is offering, and she knows what she should say. Yet, despite having a man and a baby, she still agrees to go on a date with him. It looks like she's looking for a come up. Ain't it y'all? All right, where am I picking you up from? You said you live in what area? She's really doing all of this while she's pregnant, dude. She got a man and a baby, bro. What's she gonna do when the dude finds out she has a baby? I can't even imagine what she'd be doing on a normal. That's just really crazy. She's about to tell him it's his. Her. You really can't just trust people, and that's why I'm glad I did this because this just gave me the confirmation that she ain't loyal for sure. So that gave me more reason to keep my suspicions going of who baby it is. Yeah. It's cool though, bro. I do definitely want to get her tested before you put in any child support or anything. Oh, 100%, dude. 1,000%. 100%, dude. This is heartbreaking, messed up, and sad. It's sad for Joe's art and the baby. Like, really think about it. 
Definitely hurt enough. No point in um, continuing this any further? No, nah, she, need to, she need to feel me. She need to see how I feel. No, nah, she clearly too comfortable in the car. She too comfortable uh -huh. in this environment. I need to yeah. wake her up and bring her back to reality. Her head in La La Land right now. So. I'm trying to see what's up with Madeline. <laughs> Hey, focus up, man. Focus she up. She really for the streets, though. Like. <laughs> you want to put her in, right there in the car, or you want her to come back? Oh, inside? no, we right to the car. We right can't give her a chance to try to lie about it. We got to catch her right now. Damn it, she's blocked in, too. Her car's blocked in, oh, so yeah, she, she can't go she anywhere. She can't go nowhere. Oh, oh nowhere. I just did it. Let's go. The outcome of this video was unfortunate, but on wow. the bright side, though, if Isaiah does end up being the dad, at least it's good to know that he's going to step up and be there for his kid. I hope you guys have your talkies, because you guys are wow. like, no. Wow, 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 wow. This is going to be good. Stop edging us! Uh, big ass door. Cut! What the f is this, bro? Pre gas light. What the f wrong with you? What the f is this? You know what the f this is. Who are the f you talking about? You about to go on a date with this nigga? What the f going through your hair right now? What? Why the f you all here being a? F What's your problem? Yo. Stop recording me? No, I'm not about to stop recording you. What the f you out here doing? You in his car talking about you about to go on days this down and there? What the f wrong with you? You tripping? You think I'm stupid or something? You look stupid. Nah, I don't. Bro. Yeah, low key. <laughs> she might be right. She, he looks a little stupid. He look, he's here, so. Look stupid. I just know what the f you got going on, and I need a confirmation of that f for real. You oh, tripping, shorty? I'm over this. Nah, what the f you doing? Where the f you going? We're not about to do that. You trying to run away from your problems and no, your I'm responsibilities. Not to run away. I'm not trying to you can't. Camera, you can't. Bro, you shouldn't have been out here being a. What the f you doing there? You talk about you're not trying to be on camera. I'm not trying to be out here raising a kid that ain't mine. You want me to be there, be responsible for this kid, and be there for this baby? But you out here doing niggas and like that? You got me. Bro, up. What the f are you talking about? You know what the f I'm talking about? You out here in the car playing crazy with this? F talking about you about to go on dates? And you talking about you about to drink liquor? You got a baby in your belly. You know what that? F gonna do to my kid? What the f is wrong with you? You're not thinking with your head or something? I can do whatever the f I want to do. You're not Society's cooked. No, you can't, ma'am. You have a fucking baby in your stomach. You can't do whatever you want to do because you have to prioritize the baby. Fuck is you talking about? You can't just drink because you want to, bitch. Fuck! I'm about to do what the f you want while you got my kid in your... <laughs> Some of the chat for sure just said, glad I'm gay. I wasn't able to get the name, but a nigga said that. I sort of got, I seen it, bro. Some of the chat said it. Belly, supposedly my baby. What the <laughs> bro, you, you set me up. Yeah, I set you up because you was about to set me up for 18 years. About to have me can <laughs> How the fuck y'all find that shit? Chat moving so fucking fast. Yo. <laughs> Child support on the kid that's probably what not even. What are you talking about, bro? I'm talking about you this baby. You hiring people to stalk me? Nah, don't be trying to flip this on me. Nah, I saw all these cameras out here because you could have been one, two, three, four, five niggas before you told me you had this baby in your stomach. Max. See, see right, this entire thing was basically all a test. We were just trying to help Joe's art find out if you're loyal to him or not. That's why we have all these cameras. Failing tragically. I mean, clearly, I mean, you agreed to go on a date with Isaiah. This isn't actually his house. This house is a rental. Wow. Madeline is a singer, but she doesn't really want to make a whole dance and everything for the video. So like all that was just made up. Like we- just wasting my so I'm not gonna get my money? <laughs> now you know how I feel to get your yeah, time well, wasted. Why the f do you have everyone in our business? Stop gaslighting and just say sorry. Just say sorry. I tried to keep it between me and you, but you wanted to involve all these other niggas in our situation. Now I'm just questioning who you was dealing with before you even told me you was pregnant, because it might not even be mine. Now I want a paternity test. And well, it's not. It's not yours. It's not your baby. Yeah. Did you want to hear that? So it ain't my baby. Who kid is it then? I f***ed your best friend. All right, hold on. Is this fake? Wait. Either this is the luckiest thing they've captured it in forever. Or it's fake. Because <laughs> no fucking way she admits to that. That's some shit she takes to the grave, bro. <laughs> Your friend. Hey, look, How does look, that look. feel? <laughs> Did you want to hear that? Yeah. <laughs> your friend. Hey, look. You know we don't even play like that. Don't even say like that to me before I get him out of here. Nah, you up in the head, shorty. He sounds like he's being for real, and she sounds like she's acting. How about this? I mean, I know you're worried about getting paid. So how about if I offer you a thousand dollars to go take a prenatal pregnancy test? There's a few clinics. Who the f 
for you. <laughs> yeah, wait, it might be real. <laughs> I'm Joe Zod's friend here, and I'm trying to just get to the truth at this point. My offer to you is I'll give you $1,000 if you agree to go do a prenatal pregnancy test. It's going to cost about $2,000, but I'll cover all of that. You'll get And scam her. Yeah, get the lick back. Fuck, she was about to put a baby on this nigga. She was lying. She's about to literally get drunk with a kid in her stomach. Just scam her. Pay for the test, whatever, $200, and scam her. You hit a lick. Yeah, get back, nigga. Pretty much $1,000 for taking the test. He'll know who's the actual, if he's the father or not, and everything else is covered. <laughs> wait, wait, what? So you're offering to pay her. I'll give her an extra $5,000. Why are you outbidding yourself? Damn, the nigga rich as hell. Donate the money, nigga. Fuck. The nigga just outbid himself. He's in competition. He's like, I'm in only nigga. I'm in competition with his me. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it. I'm 50 bands, bitch. Man, go take the test right now. 100 bands right now. Fact, the house is yours. I gave her six grand total. Six grand. <laughs> Why? Why? Five grand. Why? Six grand. This came out of nowhere. My man Scott was offering Sierra $6,000 to take this thing called the prenatal pregnancy test. Now, I didn't know this at the time, but it's apparently they developed ways to find out if you're the parent of a child before the baby's even born. Apparently as early as seven weeks of conception. Imagine if Jerry and Maury had this shit. Six grand. Right. Six oh, grand. Oh, six K, you look I'm over needed. this shit, bro. I'm over this shit. Oh, really? She's not saying no to six K. Not in LA, she's not. Feel me, not in that expensive city, she's not. Man, come back and take the 6K. What the fuck is you talking about? To see, because the nigga looked down bad. Nigga, nigga upped his old price and he made it seem like, bro, just tell her to take the test. You don't have to start offering money before she says no. Why are you trying to leave me? Why are you trying to leave me? You can't go nowhere don't like. Don't touch me, bro. Like, I'm out of here, bro. How you, oh, you trying to leave now? He said he paid for Your car is What's your issue, shorty? Come back. Don't Away from your problems now. You lack accountability with everything you do, and now you're trying to run away when the evidence right in front of you. That's a problem. Camera. You need to find out your morals and your standards. They in the gutter. You see what you? And you is the problem. Oh, they gotta move the rolls. Hey, we should move that before she backs into it. Holy. <laughs> well, she backed into it on video. She would be in a lot of debt, to say the least. <laughs> I can't actually think of a worse thing for her to do in this situation. <laughs> Man, that insurance gun ball. <laughs> Ooh -wee. So you're gonna have to take the bus when she sees her new insurance prices. <laughs> let me let me go move this car real quick. I left the the keys are in the car. Yo, class. Just, just, we could just let her go, bro. Cause she we gonna let her go, but she's still a you out here choosing with these niggas like I'm a I've been taking care of you from the start of all of this. You got a six K said You ran into a what? <laughs> Let, let her struggle, bro. Don't rush for nothing. Don't, don't let her control what she got going on. She don't run over here. Hey, she might back up into the rolls, bro. Kyle, you should move the rolls. She might back up into that. Keep getting nutted in. You're a oatmeal cream pie. Oh, What? <laughs> Joe's not really called her an oatmeal cream pie. What the? What does that even mean? Oatmeal cream pie. I guess I kind of get it. I don't Just get it. With her. Now, despite being offered $6,000 to take this prenatal test, Sierra refused to take it. Why? Bro, she just said on video that it's not his, my nigga. You don't need a test, bro. Show that to the judge. I don't know. Maybe it's because of her ego. Maybe it's because she knows it's not Joe's arts. Or maybe it's because she of what she, she says. Gave, she gave him the answer for- Joke's on you. There's no baby. Bye. Fuck you. <laughs> yeah. She really just said that. Yeah, I don't know if she was being serious or not, but uh, she just said there was no baby. She just said there's no baby? She said there's no baby. No way. You said you recorded it, you got it on yeah, camera? No, no way. Yeah, we gotta, you gotta yeah, spin yeah. that back for me. So you telling me, so you telling, so you telling me that it ain't no baby? There, There is no baby in the first place? Oh yeah, hey, careful, hey, careful. Joe's come back here, Joe's There's no baby in the first place? Yeah, don't, don't, don't let her, yeah, don't you let her. You crazy as what the f is wrong with you? You! Take your ass on somewhere. Let's see that footage. I want to see that footage. She deleted the baby. I don't rule out the possibility that there really is no baby, but I don't know. She's super mad. She might just be talking out of her ass. This revelation is shocking, but I kind of take it with a grain of salt. Like what is even the truth at this point? I don't condone all the, the being thrown out, but <laughs> this is why you. I do, she just cheated on him.
<laughs> she nigga, nigga went to review the play like a referee. <laughs> to review the play like he the referee man he's basically just about to play me <laughs> i don't know bro. just to try to like get the bread out of me bro. Like, you think she's being honest there i don't know i'm a little 50 50. Uh, she's a little too mad she, she's, she's been she's, 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 she's she only told me about a month or two ago so i can't even tell by the stomach if she really pregnant or not i feel like she was trying to f with you the whole confrontation because she she was telling you oh the baby's not yours i your friend and now she's telling you there is no baby yep. i think anything is possible at this point he's right what does get me is the whole like why didn't she take the the money i took that as like dude if she was telling the truth why wouldn't she just say exactly it? she's telling the truth it's great even if she is telling the truth, she's done for in the, in the case of me feeling any feelings for her. Even if she's pregnant and the kid is mine, she just gonna have to learn how to deal with it from a distance. Go what? And how would you, wait, what? Co-parent and I get my kid on Oh, co-parent, oh, okay, oh, oh, oh okay, okay. <laughs> As we were packing equipment, Sierra texted Joe's that she wanna talk. Joe's heart requested privacy. But I request you put a mic on a nigga next time. Nigga, I'm nosy. Come on, bro. I'm a nosy guy. I want to know what he had to say. Hey. W video. I actually, there was a moment where it felt like it was fake, but I think it was real. If I, I put it on, I'll put my money on real. Oh, so you like the video. Boom. You, you know, you're gonna like that one too, man. Go ahead, just. Bro, click the game. What that? Bro, that's what I be saying. Like